Hey there Sprouts, today we're making one of my favorite comfort foods and that's spaghetti and meatballs. Let's get started. We're going to start by seasoning our meat. I'm using a pound of ground beef and turkey, but you can use whatever you would like. To that, we're going to add eggs, milk, onions, and breadcrumbs. Give it a nice mix with clean hands. Then add basil, Italian seasoning, and onion powder, minced garlic, chopped cilantro, salt and pepper, and freshly grated Parmesan cheese. And this is optional, but I find that adding cumin will really enhance all the flavors in the meat, so give it a try. Spray a baking tray with non-stick cooking spray and form your meat into small balls. Make sure they are all uniform so they can cook evenly. Then you'll bake at 400 degrees for 20 minutes. Then you'll turn them over and bake again at 350 for another 10 minutes. Set those aside and go ahead and cook your pasta according to the package directions. Make sure you save about a half a cup of pasta water for the sauce later. Once the pasta is all finished cooking, you can go ahead and place it in a separate bowl and add some olive oil to prevent sticking. And now we can work on our sauce. I know I only have five here, but if you can, put eight Roma tomatoes in a pot, add garlic and olive oil, and just smush them up. This part is so fun. Just make sure your hands are really clean. Next, you'll want to put it on a stove top on medium high heat and add basil, salt and pepper to taste. Put the lid on and reduce the heat to low. After that simmers for a few minutes, go ahead and add Italian seasoning, brown sugar, and a little bit of that pasta water. Give it a nice stir and then remove a ladle full of sauce and add some cornstarch, which acts as our thickening agent. Add it back in and simmer on low for about 10 minutes, stirring occasionally. Then you'll add your cooked meatballs and it's ready to eat. Plate it up and enjoy this delicious plate of spaghetti and meatballs. I like to garnish mine with a little bit of freshly grated Parmesan cheese and some more basil. Just look at how gorgeous this is! And then of course my favorite part of cooking, eating! Did you even have spaghetti if you don't eat it like Lady in the Tramp style? <laughs> As always, two thumbs up for me. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more recipes. Thanks for watching!